Michigan Tech's home opener on the ice is tomorrow versus the Notre Dame Fighting Irish. The rich history in the Copper Country has been rather influential to the Notre Dame program. ABC 10's Thomas Fournier has more on the story. Michigan Tech plays their home opener against the Notre Dame Fighting Irish on Friday, October 15th. This is not the first or the last time these teams will meet. In fact, the Copper Country has had a large impact on the Notre Dame hockey program even before they played their first collegiate game in 1921, according to writer John Heisler. So I'm going to be talking about the formative years of Notre Dame hockey. They played their first informal hockey games in 1912 and 13, and then they took a break right around the World War I years, and they played their first intercollegiate game in 1921, and that was up in Houghton against the Michigan College of Mines, now Michigan Tech. Their second game was at Calumet Coliseum, and they, they lost the first night and won the second night. And on all of those teams, um, 1912, 1913, 1920, 21, 22, and 23, featured at least one player from Calumet. Heisler would talk about the historical impact Calumet residents had on the program, especially how Bill Gray started a pipeline of Copper Country athletes to the school. Gray attended Notre Dame for a law degree and played on both the Notre Dame baseball and hockey team. And it's the 100th anniversary for both teams. Michigan Tech started in, in 1921 with two games against the University of Michigan. And then Michigan Tech's third and fourth intercollegiate game was actually against Notre Dame. It will be Notre Dame's first and second intercollegiate game. Tech and Notre Dame both started within a week of each other playing intercollegiate hockey in 1921. It's very rare to see Notre Dame play a game up here. And they're coming up on the 15th, the home opener for Michigan Tech. Heisler's talk will be on Michigan Tech's campus tomorrow night in the East Reading Room in the Van Pelt Opie Library. This seminar starts at 6 p.m. If you are interested in learning about the history of collegiate hockey and the athletes of Calumet, this event is free to attend. This is Thomas Fournier with ABC 10 and CW5. Thank you for watching ABC 10 News on YouTube. To get the latest on sports, news, and weather, subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook.